Hello and welcome to episode 21 of my QB Factorium tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on continuing my settlement and working on my inventory target, namely copper and iron. So you can see, let's show you around so you can see that I've let my grove fill up the wood. Oh, why is it paused? My groves filled up the wood, my kilns have filled up the charcoal and the bricks. Um, that's full of clay, well, nearly full. Uh, the wells, you can see, the two wells are keeping up nicely, just like the two farms of strawberries and tomatoes. They're both keeping up nicely as well. Got all my houses built, except for I need place for my two pigs. You'll notice you have two pigs. I've not mentioned pigs before, um, but they are good at doing the hauling logistics, so they will carry all the stuff around for you, and that's pretty much all they do. But still, it'd be nice to give them a home, so maybe we'll do that in this episode. The first thing I want to do, though, is clear up all of these objects that are still on the ground, and they are uh, iron blanks, gold blocks, iron blocks, uh, construction blocks, copper ore, gold ore and iron ore, so all of these items and coming up here to the inventory target remember that I need 15 track parts, 5 copper ore and 5 iron ore to meet the inventory goal to move on to the next island so I'm going to start by building a big bonfire to expand this area over here and then I'm going to build a stockpile for all of these items. So let's do the bonfire first of all. Remember Alt left click will clone um, a building for you, in this case a big bonfire. So I'm going to put it just there and I might need a second one up here, just there. Go. Okay, now I'm going to do a stockpile and I'm going to keep it in line with that. I can always expand it. And in there, I want to store iron blanks, gold blocks. Iron blocks, yeah, I want them as well. Um, where's the copper? Gold ore. Construction block. Oh, mined iron. Just looking for mined copper now. Oh, there we go, we expanded the territory. Let's have a look, see if I can find it with copper. Oh, there we are, copper ore. Right, so that should hopefully now tidy up. Oh, what are these? Oil barrel and cocoa beans. So, let's do that oil barrel. If I can f oh, cocoa beans. Might as well put them in there. And where's the oil barrel? There we are. Okay, so for the tools, I might stick them in separate. What's that? Track parts. So let's put the track parts in there as well. I'll just use this um, stockpile just to collect everything up. If I have a lot of one item, I'll make a separate stockpile for it. How does that sound? That's machine railed wooden part, refined wooden parts. So let's put that in there. If I can see what it looks like. There you go. That one. Let's put the shovels in there. Iron pickaxe. Iron 
and sword. Right, hopefully that should be everything off the ground. So the land is looking pretty clear. Ah, right, so we got this boulder still here. Or is it? No, right, okay, it's time to get rid of all of this. So let's do mine and harvest. Alt, left click. Same for the flowers. same for the stone. Over here you can see we got wheat, so we're going to be able to do a wheat farm. Yay. Oh, let's speed it up. Get things done a bit quicker. We only have 20 minutes after all. Okay, let's get rid of these trees. Get rid of this. And just to show you what it is, it's a deserted house. Abandoned long ago, but it can be mined for one rock. So we'll just mine it to clear the land. sand I'm going to need to do as well. Oh, it's Desert Mountain. It's not showing what it can be mined for, so let's just mine it. And this. Up here, where they're going to be mining, you can see there's copper in the desert mountain. So if we have a look at it, yeah, you see that says can be mined for five copper ore. And here is the iron ore. So that's our inventory target. Well, we've done the iron now, just the copper to do. So now we're just on the track parts. Sand goad. That could be mined for iron, copper, and rock. So yeah, we definitely want to mine that. That's a lot more. Right, so let's have a look how the storage is getting on. Yeah, I think I'm going to need to do a separate one for iron and copper. So there's going to be a lot of it. is going to be there. Stone is all right. Okay, so we've done the iron and the copper. Next is the track parts. So we need a metal workshop for that. suspecting we're going to need an ore smelter before the metal workshop. So let's have a look. Metal workshop. 
you need one brick, one wooden part, one iron block, which I have enough for all of that. But we will need an ore smelter to smelt all this ore, which need one brick, one stone block, and so I've got plenty. Plenty bricks, plenty stone blocks, so that's what I want to do next. An ore smelter. Where am I going to put it? Would make sense to put it near to the place the item is being stored, so I'm going to put it down here. Let's do another stockpile. Right? And let's do that big. Let's do copper ore again. You know? And let's do another one. What is this? Conveyor parts. Oh, have I not got that selected for here? I'll move that now. I no, don't like that. Torches. No, we don't need the torch there. I don't know if I can destroy them. I don't think I can. Machine parts. Is that not selected in there? Right, this one, we, I want to turn off the copper ore from it. And the mined iron. So I don't want it accepting copper ore, and I don't want it accepting iron. Iron can go in this one. There we go. Let's run a road. To there. And the next nice thing to do here would be, of course, an ore smelter. And what we want to do is select this stockpile of copper. Set it to there, stockpile of iron, set it to there. We're going to need two stockpiles for the outputs. So we can have one there. And we can have one there. Perhaps it's too much, I don't know. And I want to make iron blocks to start with. And they can go in there. Copper blocks can go in there. No, I don't want that on. Yeah, so that's it, right. Oops, I've done the wrong one. There's copper I want in there. Let's put that back to iron. Or oh no, may as well just leave them both set. They'll fill up the stockpiles that way. Right, so I suspect it needs charcoal. Yep, there we go. So you're, for your ore smelter, make sure you've built up your charcoal beforehand. 
And there it goes, off it's going. Once it's filled up the iron block stockpile, then it'll start filling up the copper block stockpile. first iron block. Right, so let's go back and have a look at the metal workshop. Right, so for the metal workshop, one brick, one wooden part and one iron block. Now, I don't think I've been making wooden parts, so I'm going to need a stockpile for wooden parts. And the basic workshop is the one that does that, so I'm going to create another stockpile not too big. That big. Do wooden parts. And they can go in there. Then that gives us all the materials that we're going to need to make the metal workshop. <clears throat> and why have you put that in? So you just put that in because I first had it selected. They won't take it out, of course, because the wooden board stockpile is full. Fine. I'm not going to worry about that. Right. So wooden parts don't need to go in here anymore. Oh, that's a refined wooden part. I don't suppose I mind them being in there. Yeah, so that's okay. Call cool, me iron's nearly full. What's that? Harvested cotton. Oh, have I not got any left for cotton? Let's put the cotton in there. Wooden part needs wooden board, stone block, and harvested wheat. Oh, that's why. I need wheat. And guess what? Over here, we've got a wheat field. So, let's do a farm and a stockpile for it. So, I'm going to need to harvest it. So, I'm going to have to do the stockpile first. And the stockpile... can go there. And now... I want to harvest this wheat. And the wheat, I want to go in there. Yep, yeah, there we go, so harvested wheat. This will be our farm, so we go to the farm. And I'm going to cover all of the tiles, except for my stockpile of course. I don't want you to do my stockpile. There we go. Now I need to put the stockpile back. Better. 
Oh, there's the timer. So, right, okay. As you can see now, we're going to have a wheat farm. And the wheat farm, we'll put it in the wheat in there. Once we've got the wheat, we can then get... I find it very strange that the wooden part needs wheat. But apparently, that's what it needs. And who am I to argue? So, the next thing I need to do is tell it the wheat is for them. And it'd be nice to do a road. So, let's do a road for them to run along. So, put it to there and there and there there we go road all the way to the farm right time has gone i'll carry this on in the next episode when we will build a metal workshop wherever you are in the world god bless you and keep you safe thank you for watching and have a fantastic day goodbye